Alrighty. Alrighty, it's finally raining. Woohoo, this is it. The grand moment we've been waiting on. So, as you can see, this game really shines when it rains. I mean, when it's daytime, this game does really not look better than Grand Theft Auto Online. But you can tell that the, uh, the, the tessellation of the water, and you can tell they use some procedural textures. This game really looks the best at night, no joke. In the morning, I think the PC version would look next-gen, but currently the, the Xbox One and PlayStation 4 version at in the morning don't look better than Grand Theft Auto 4 last-gen. They don't. Um, but I'm sure on PC it will. And the nighttime looks just as good as the PC version. I'd say the PC version is more superior, but still, this is really good looking. Great graphics. They way better than the Grand Theft Auto Online weather system. Uh, text, the, the reflections on the floor, the subsurface scattering of the light, the, glo uh, the global illumination. I'd say it's way better than Grand Theft Auto 5 uh, in terms of weather and at nighttime. So um, here I have the IED, you know, it's like a bomb. Okay, so then, okay, I totally forgot I could do that. Proximity, IED, so I can craft that. Find that gas station again. Let's see where I am. So I'm. Oh, I'm actually right by it. I think. Or it should be right about there. So let me just. Oh yeah, there it is. Sweet. Look out! He has a gun. I just need to get into a car. Ah! Oh, no, don't take my car. Uh, 
playing me a song. So, well, that didn't very much seem like a big explosion, but I mean, it's still a really visually impressive game at night, though I wish the explosion was bigger, like E3 2012, though I do think that's a PC physics feature. 